If only I had a holdover. This is so BS. Maybe I should have hunted, like specifically g gone and hunted for the holdover. Hey guys, welcome back to Monster Train. And I have my mic like this now. Uh, hopefully this is better. So like I have my, I have the front of the mic right in front of my mouth here. Uh, so that it can capture the sound like right here. So that I uh, I don't encounter those uh, times when I uh, get really soft sound and then sometimes when I'm like really loud, it's uh, the variation is pretty high. <laughs> So hopefully this is better, um, yeah. As for Monster Train wise, we will be going to for Fragile Collection again with um, Umbra and Stygian. If I don't get this, if I fail again, I might need to uh, do it off camera, but hopefully we do this, we can actually do this. Super food. Ha! Ah, super food. Shit. Do I... Do I need super food? Can I do it without super food? Hmm... Let me try again. Maybe I can do it without super food. Because this doesn't... It's not great. Let's take the shadow box. I'm gonna try to do it without superfood because the superfood is just so difficult to play with this uh, fragile here. And I mess up immediately. Sky. Okay. Okay. Um still gonna take the perils here. And offering token. Okay. I would say alloy construct, but it's 
uh, wait, I, I do have a station banner, so probably alloy it. <laughs> or Eel Gorgon, I keep on pronouncing L. Wait a minute. Can I make it work? Okay, so because it removes all status effects, it removes all negative status effects as well. And thus, it can actually remove the fragile. So, every single turn I have to play as many cards as I can and I also need to... I want to give a quick? Oh, I can't give a quick. Right, quick doesn't work. Uh, and of course, damage shield doesn't work. I'm gonna try to make this Yield Gorgon work. How well is it gonna be? I'm not, I really don't know. Okay, so no quick. How do I survive then? Just need a bunch of health? There is... Okay, so there is no point to put the alloy construct on it. I'm gonna try this experiment. Experiment. Here, here. Pretty good, I think. I think it's pretty good. Guardian's amulet. I ice tornado is also good. Let's take this. Let's take this.
conscription notice. Ah,、uh, go. I'm gonna. I might need to go all in on this Eel Gorgon. I might go in all in. <laughs> Feel like I have to. Oh my god. <sighs> so other ways to go conscription notice, and then I play. So I play my champion with the Eel Gorgon, and then I have the. I put other morsels with the conscription notice. Or I can get a Shadow Eater. I think I'm still. I still need two floors. Kidding me? Okay, so、uh, let's do this. Do here, here. Is just so dumb. Oh my god! I keep on messing this up. <laughs> How do I do this? Let's do. Let's do this. Flying kill. Okay, <laughs> it's pretty good, but it's、uh, there's a lot of thinking. Let's take the Umbra Stone and take the Siren of the Sea. Take a Light of Seraph now. Enemy unit center is damage shield one. I have to、uh, have to do this with like I have to play this two. I have to complete two rounds, right, with this trinkets. So I think the ten damage shield might work. So this will give my units、uh, endless. That doesn't help me, anyways. So I'll take this damage shield. This should be okay, and then I I don't take any of the other ones.
approach. Buffet five. Okay. I mean, uh, or I can just go aggressive and then try. I'm thinking I actually now want the <laughs> status effect because uh, because this this guy can just cleanse all the status effect. Let's go aggressive. Another spell chain. Piercing. Gonna have piercing. Morsel Master, sure. Lower the cost. Uh, okay. Are you serious? Spell shields? Oh man. I feel like it's fine. Oh my god, I keep on forgetting. Uh, no, this guy first. Okay, it's gonna block the... Okay, I have piercing here. Pretty good. <laughs> Still working. Working pretty nicely. Okay, um... Should've done it, should put the morsel on the bottom.
Okay. The fact that it can gain, um, uh, uh, what's it? Uh, the fact that it can gain multi strike is so good. Let's take the engine upgrade. Take the Titan's tooth. Ooh, there's Yinkankin armor. <laughs> That's what I should have put on the Yo Gorgon. Forgot, I forgot that this existed. <laughs> Endless. This guy costs two to play though. <laughs> Like, I was hoping that I can actually get something good. Like some HP gaining car- uh, gaining, uh, upgrades, but no- no dice? When a card with consumers play, deal 3 damage, takes the wing clippings. Really? Uh, okay. Seven times eight is fifty-six. I can't survive. So I need to have conserve HP. Conserve as much HP as I can. And also play. Maybe I don't play the Morsel Master on the top floor. This 25 health here is kind of bad.
25 to 19, I guess that's an improvement. Still 23, uh, 23 damage there. Like, wait, I can actually put the Shadow Eater in front of th this guy. Just as a blocker. I should have actually just. Wait, I don't have enough. I somehow don't have enough hits. And I thought the pyre has piercing. But apparently... The pyre doesn't have piercing because I was taking double damage from the damage shield. Okay, so that is 12, 14, 14, and then... 14 plus 2, 16, 16 plus another uh, 4 uh, plus another 6, 14 plus another 6, 20, 20 plus 4, 5, 6, maybe 6, 12, 20 plus 12. 32? I... I don't know... I, I want to keep higher health. A higher higher health, to be exact. Let's do this... Do... This... This... Here... And... Here. Yeah, the part doesn't have piercing. <laughs> that is surprise. That's a very surprising discovery because I, I. They remember it have piercing. Okay, let's play these out and do this. Okay, I need one spell here. Um, actually let's do that. Okay, I actually killed something. Um, here?
Okay. Uh, let's do this. I'll do this. Right here. Draw. Go here. Just use for the stats. Okay. Doesn't really matter. Just need to play everything. Can't really take white binding. Uh, yeah. Engine upgrade. Another one? Don't think I need another one. Let's take this. Okay. Damage spell skip piercing. I mean, I can try to go for the concealed caverns for... Go for the concealed caverns for the Yul Gorgon and try to duplicate Yul Gorgon. Like to go uh, get to try to get a smaller size the event. Yeah, it's a uh, very betting heavy. <laughs> Very gamblery. Sure. Multi strike. Okay, here's a large stone. Maybe I should have pur no, I don't have that many parts to purge anymore. Do this and this and I'll put this here. Let's kill this guy. This here, uh, do, do the trample. I fucked up. Oh well. It's fine. Let me go with... Oh shit, wait. This guy has stealth.
That is going to suck a lot. I mean, I guess this shadow box is, can come in handy pretty, like sometimes. It's like when it does, it's actually pretty good. Uh, let me put this here, put this here, and here. Actually, just let me let me put this here first. One, two, three, four. That's times times two, three, four, five. That's five. Times five. Um, it's not nearly enough, but I can just do that. Do this. Pearls of production. Let's just do this for the stats. Frost Effigy Wretch 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 Takes a draw Let's go this way I have a lot of money 260 That leaves me 330 Okay, that actually worked out. Okay. Oh. <laughs> um, no, I need to sacrifice it. I, I can't... I can't keep that around. I was thinking of not sacrificing it, but it doesn't... It's not gonna work out very well. Upgraded with melee weakness. 
Is that gonna be... Is that a... Status effect? I, uh, I'm actually not sure if that's a status effect or not. Upgrade a unit. Let me... I'm gonna check my... <laughs> old videos and see and then I will get back okay I think I should I test it out let me look on Google melee weakness is it a trigger <laughs> I actually can't find it it's called thunderstone sapstone thunderstone Upgrade a unit with strike, apply melee weakness. I think that is a... actually... That is a purple upgrade. So it'll actually work. Okay. Mark of Unexiled. This will give me like 5 HP. Okay, I d <laughs> there was a bug where where the my units would also where my units would also get the this max health here. So I mean these two are not very good at all. So let's just take that. Maybe it'll work. I there like it is a bug. So. Who knows? only the 16 damage oh I can't even trample because trample is a status effect Trample doesn't even work. Done that by twenty seven.
Oh, I'm gonna kill myself on the spikes. Well, that's the way to go. Okay, let's do this. This guy here. Grovel is not what I need. Skip. Take a silence. What I need is hold over. <laughs> Come on. Hold over, man. This could, can use hold over. Uh, this really needs hold over. God damn it. Another spell chain. Duplicate this, you Gorgon. If I duplicate it, so I can put two of them on the same level. And then what? The thing is, and then what? I don't have a way to give it health. Oh my god, if only I got it uh, you can't gain armor instead of the freaking stupid health. But then the thing here is that my primordium is gonna die. 
And also my more swords are gonna die too. Duplicate the days? That's the only thing I can think of that makes sense that can help me. I might just die here, like die on the next fight, on the last divinity. Simply because I don't have a way to heal. So I can beat Seraph, but I don't think I can beat Last Divinity. I do have the gaining 1 HP per thing here, but how good is that? I, to be honest, I just don't know. This is so annoying.
Uh, okay. Are you... wait, what? Okay... I mean... This sucks. <laughs> God damn it. I will try again, but this is like not having like his consistent way to heal is such a big problem. I'm making the same mistake. Yeah, yeah. If only I had a holdover. Yes. Maybe I should have hunted, like specifically g gone and hunted for the holdover. Um What? <laughs> uh no frenzy swarm
Okay, there is a frenzy swarm. Get rid of this. Very close. Okay. Okay, there it is. Holy shit. Whew. Oh my god. This this shadow box helped me so much there. It cleared out a lot uh almost all of the enemies and then I was able to just get straight to the boss instead. Okay, wow. It's <laughs> pretty good. It is pretty good. Like, so just get a lot of the triggers. Um, by triggers, I mean the purple upgrades on the Yo Gorgon. That way you can uh, buff it up. Uh, so some of the good ones are armor. Armor. So instead, uh, so I remember uh, like that I purged a uh, alloy construct. Uh, I got another alloy construct and that got a Yo Gorgon. I should have, I get like in hindsight, like knowing everything, I should have gotten the Guard of the Unnamed from the, um, from the uh, challenge awards, uh, in the first ring, and then, uh, instead of the alloy construct. And then I put a, a guard of the unnamed onto the Yo Gorgon, and that way he can get the armor triggers uh, every time. He gets two armor per spell uh, instead of one attack and one health uh, from the Siren of the Sea here. But like, but the uh, two armor I think is more beneficial and more helpful. And then instead of getting the Hearthstone. The uh, third of uh, uh, like the third Hearthstone there, I should have saved it. Maybe I couldn't have saved it because I had there's the other Hearthstone there. So maybe that was the correct choice to fill up all of the uh, all of the slots and go for the Hearthstone and then the mi the mini weakness Thunderstone afterwards. Maybe that's that is the correct choice still did it after the tournament I have been starting to pick up more pack shards and uh, getting used to higher pack shards uh, boss fights um, getting used to the the damage of the enemies damage of the last divinity get damage of the seraph uh, in these higher pack shards fights uh, I mean it's this more difficult, but you do get the awards of obviously from the from getting all of these pack shards. So that is good. Yeah, special shout out to the <laughs> shadow box. Really nice, really nice in some very clutch uh, kills there, like in especially in the end, and very nice. Very like was able to actually did done a third three turn boss rush for the last divinity.
yeah so very okay uh challenge done challenge done we'll do i guess homework this will be really a lot of thinking <laughs> like maybe i should i should just do this with the melting remnant you know what? Like, I, I, I will just do... Okay. One, Melting Remnant. One, Melting Remnant. These I will do something else. Probably Melting Remnant. Probably Melting Remnant as well. And these... Spells cost plus one. Maybe Yimp Tech? Maybe a Yimp Tech here? And then... Mountain Remnant. <laughs> yeah, Mountain Remnant seems very nice. Like, so most of these will be Mountain Remnant. I mean, not most of these. A lot of these are going to be Mountain Remnant. One, uh, no. One, two, three, four, five. Maybe the Celsius bosses. Maybe it works. Maybe it doesn't work. Uh, I'll have to see. But the, the, the duality, it, it does help me. So. I think there might be some play with the duality with Stygian. Maybe I can do melting melting Stygian with the Stelltis bosses just to revive, uh, just for the revival, and then and then kill. So that might might work. So either four or five melting remnant uh, challenges here. So I will do um, the ones that are not going to be Mountain Remnants. Uh, so next it's probably it's going to be Steward Stack first. We will do uh, Hellhorn Steward sna Stack Snack Stack Hellhorn I can go with Stygian. Let's check. Hellhorn. Hellhorn first. Uh, okay. Hellhorn Awoken? I can try to get a Hellhorn uh, Wormkin here. Wormkin units. They do, ha they do have a lot of room. <laughs> They do take up a lot of the room, I mean. Let's do this and a Wormkin. Takes the Echo Break and then we'll do this. We'll do it like this. So yeah. Store stack. Uh, hopefully this works well. I mean, it's not a difficult... I don't think it's going to be difficult at all. Uh, especially with the this uh, Sketches of Salvation here. So should be pretty good. Anyways, with that all being said, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video with the Eel Gorgon. Finally mastered the Eel Gorgon. Anyways, consider subscribing if you haven't and I hope to see you all in the next video. Peace.